character is something that uh, actors use as, remember my premise is that we are all insecure, we are all lazy, and we all complicate that which is simple, and then simplify that which is complex. Character is uh, something that I see actors hide behind all the time. But my character would never, I'm like, stop it. I don't care what you think your character would never. What is your character doing? That's all you fucking worry about. Do that. If you're in the, uh, my character would never land, it means you don't understand the script. Because the script is telling you what the character's doing. It's an instruction sheet. It's telling you what to do. If you're like, but I would never do that. Well, then you obviously don't understand the script because the script is saying, do that. <laughs> yeah? And anyway, by the way, human beings are intensely self-contradictory and are always doing things that they don't mean to do. <laughs> I would never do that. But also, like... <sighs> So are you ready to do the scene? Yeah, um, I did a little bit of character background research. I'm like, oh, you, you called the writer? <laughs> no, I'm serious. Michael Richards, who's one of my students, um, he's doing um, Dreamer Examines His Pillow, and he does not understand his character. So he gets online, Googles John Patrick Shanley, finds his email address, and writes him a big long letter. Can you explain me? Within two days, Shanley wrote him back and the whole explanation of the character and wished him luck on his play. Oh, yeah. Life is there for you, just ask for it. Yeah, you know. Um, uh, I did a character background research. I'm like, oh, what'd you do? I wrote a character history for myself. I'm like, oh. Yeah, I made a collage. Yeah. Read, it, read, it. read it to me. And it's, um, well, I decided that my character was, you know, born and bred in Ecuador. Like, I studied in a private school. And I decided that my character, and I go, that's great, you should write that movie. But if you want to do this scene, what are you doing? Like, what are you doing? It, why are you inventing all that shit? That shit's nothing. All that's going to do is direct you away from what the script is telling you to do. All you're doing is hiding from the simple but very painful complex truth of what's on the page. All you're doing is shirking your responsibility of being really fucking unbelievable scene analysts by making a bunch of stuff up that's not even there in the first place. If you're working with a director and they say, yeah, walk away and make a character bio, your director's um, silly. And don't do that. Don't, if your actors have been doing that or, or, or directors have been doing that, stop. Because all you're doing is directing people away from the script. You know? Are there artful, creative, wonderful things that you can do in order to inhabit and find your character? Yes. Did Johnny Depp work with a coach and then kind of discover that Keith Richards would be a great way to play it? Yeah, but it comes from the source. It comes from the kernel of the script. It's not going out and... Uh, usually when characters bring in character bios and stuff, they're, they're, they're way down the wrong track now. And it's so, and then we're doing the scene, and I'm like, why are you doing it that way? And like, oh, because my, my, you know, my character went to a British boarding school in Ecuador. I'm like, no, they didn't! You made that up! <laughs> so you're justifying this non-action with something that's not justifiable. Why are you inventing stuff that doesn't exist in the story?